<laughs> All right, welcome back, people, to MG Sports TV. Thank you very much, people, for tuning in. Thank you very much for taking just the 10 seconds out of your day to watch this video. Bailey, 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 Bailey. No, um, so well, most of you are supposed to know. I think one and two of you know, so me, an Arsenal supporter. And what the video hard to do. <laughs> the video hard to do. Hit the like button, people. Hit the subscribe button. If you're here for the first time, good morning, good afternoon, whichever time when you're watching this. One. So, we're going to discuss Leon Daly. I'm going to have to say, first goal breaking the deadlock in the fourth minute of the game versus Arsenal. Um, it's actually a good goal. Nice, 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 cheeky moving off the, 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 the blind side of the defenders. Them not seeing you. And then took it away quite nicely. Unfortunately, it's against Arsenal. Ending Arsenal title whoops. Very. Very unfortunate. The funny, the funny thing about it, when me see, me not see me nice starting lineup, me I say, you know what? That's a positive. That's a good. That's one good because we know so we play the island. Arsenal play the island, and that particular island can cause problem because uh, Bailey very fast. So I say, you know what? Seems in the panic bench. All right, we have one less PC player for worry about. Little did we know. <laughs> Little did we know. Give me a second, let's look at something. Little did we know. Little did we know that in the middle of the game, can change the concept of the game, can change the concept of the league. Now, luckily, the, the good thing is that they, they are fighting for a, 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 a San Villa, Liam Bale and San Villa fight for a fourth place position um, between fourth and fifth. Big, big battle between them and Tottenham. And any win is, is vital to them. Any three points, any point is really, really vital to them. And Bale came on to give them that feeling of, you know, we can go on and win this game. And also that feeling of adding more pressure on Arsenal where the title challenge is concerned. I have to say, they look a lot fresher. They look with good legs. Now, when we see the game I go on, I say, all right, fair enough, we are, we are in control of the game first half, dominated first half, I say, second half now come out flat. Then now, later on in the game, I see Bailey come on and I see my warm up, I say, all right, at least at this point in time, we kind of push him back deeper. Well, I push him back way, way deeper, so I don't think we are going to really worry about that. But guess what, the deeper we push him back, at the higher our line is going to be. And funny enough, the goal them score is actually not a running, uh, not a basically running behind the space of the back line. It's actually just like a cross and it won't just creep up behind the centre back and, and, and tuck it away. Nevertheless, big goal, big, big factor, big, big impact he made in this game. I have to say that um, for a good while now, his performances are not necessarily of the highest. Um, people might dis dis disagree with that. But I have to say that he, the cameo that he came on can give was, was actually a really good one. He came on and gave a good account of himself at the detriment of Arsenal losing despite that. And me I said, me I said, me I look on me I see my wall. Me I said, you know, so the sharp boy probably won't come get some trouble on the field though. That me I said to myself, you know, me I say, I said, me not pay that no mind. Me when the man scored, me I say, yo, <laughs> I can't believe, I can't believe, say, this man can score power we, and he never did that versus Man City. A man City is an ideal team for you that against and he never did it and I win can't do it and boy. It break me. It break me still, I'm not gonna lie. Lucky lucky that what I do. Them time I actually not travel me I got much. So I kinda couldn't go, get to do a reaction after that. But a big goal by him, big cameo, really, really good cameo. I think that 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 that, that short stint was, was something. But what I did realize though, for the two games that Aston Villa played against Manchester City and Arsenal, then, then, go to, then, go, then go to the similar structure and format. Now, what's, what does that do or what does that say about Leon Daly? Um, I can be viewing this a bit wrong, but I think it's more so um, an aspect where the defensive aspect of his game, maybe uh, um, Emery was a bit worried about the defensive work rate that he might, he might provide. So what he did was just bring him on later in the game where he can come and make some impact. And that's the same thing happened when he played against Man City. came on in the 68th minute as well. Um, they start off with more a more defensive-minded set of players who can track back because they know that they will be playing without the ball for a long period of time. So that kind of gives us a little bit of in there. Um, maybe maybe not everyone see it that way. Maybe because it's just, it's just a tactical thing. But um, I, would, I would implore you to go and watch back 
the games that they played against the teams that will hold possession and cause problems, um, he tend to come off the bench in the latter stages of the game. Um, more than likely to get his pace because he's fresh and stuff. But it's, it's, a, it's a really, really interesting observation. As I said, not many might agree with it. But nevertheless, um, it's just my observation and what I think. I think it's just more of a tactical situation where as he, he's not the best, he doesn't have the highest level of defensive work rate. So maybe Emery said, you know what, since he doesn't have that high work rate, high defensive work rate, we, want, we don't want to risk it. So maybe that's, that, that's definitely an area that he has to sharpen up on. Um, I don't know, but I think, I think that's, that's the case. Uh, maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm wrong. Um, people are going to come in the comment section and give me a, a proper explanation of why he, he went on to do that. But, nevertheless, um, big performance from him, I have to say, at the detriment of my happiness. <laughs> um, but, as a football go, um, big up yourself again, massive respect, good performance, good cameo, um, quite an interesting one. Um, let's see if this can count, let's see how far he can take Aston Villa. Whoa, what going on? No, 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 what going on? No, what going on to the camera? Anyways, you know what? Since the camera act up, that means the camera tell me say I don't time now. Be good to people. See you guys again. Until next time, MG Sports TV. Like, share, subscribe. If you're here for the first time, I'll see you guys again. Until next time. Roll. God bless. Peace out. Boom.